Tomorrow on Sunday Northwest, we'll be talking to Manchester United boss Alex Ferguson and the Labour Member of Parliament for Bootle, James MacDonald. So, for an in-depth look at all the region's news and issues affecting the Granada area, join me, William Broom, at half past one for Sunday Northwest tomorrow, only on Granada. Big issue of the day. Why do you think more people voted for Brian and Helen in Big Brother than voted at the general election? Oh, that's a, a very interesting question. I think because far more people are interested in other people's lives than they are politics. So what has Brian and Helen got that William Hague and Tony Blair haven't? Well, they've got a bit more style, they've got a bit more charisma about them, haven't they? They've got a lot more oomph. They're a lot more lively, aren't they? They're just boring. More style, more charisma? Sounds like you, John. Well, it's not just you there, is it, Wayne? You've, apparently you've got a fellow cast member. Yes, that's we have. We've got Charlie now. Come on, Charlie, don't be shy. He's oh, quite a shy Charlie. little fella. He's a shy boy, isn't he? I've met a few like him. Yeah, he's a... So what have you got to watch out for, Wayne? Well, in the Panther, you've got to watch out because Charlie will be popping up every now and again. And when you see Charlie kids, I want you to say, Hello, Charlie! Hello Charlie, I'm still a kid. <laughs> tell me one more thing Wayne, just tell us the Granada viewers how we can see the Panto. Yes, if you want to book the Panto seat, please phone 0800 642 843 and you'll be able to get your theatre tickets. We're running until February and it's going to be a fantastic show. He's been plugging me all night. <laughs> <laughs> well thanks very much Wayne, that's Wayne here in Granada tonight. Wayne, don't leave it so long next time, thanks. Carol. Thanks, Carol. With Posh Spice's new single out on Monday, we've got, and this is a good one, we've got Christina Samachata, Posh Spice's hairstylist, with us right now. Thanks, Christina, for coming on the show. Hi. Now, I want to get to the nitty-gritty. What is it actually like working with Posh Spice? Very, very, very difficult. I mean, you can see what she's like with her clothes already. I mean, constantly, if I'm not putting one strand here correctly, she can keep me there for a good two hours doing the same blow dry over and over again but she just always always problems can't handle her um is she I'm really actually hoping to find someone else is she <laughs> really really is she a really bad customer difficult well at first she was really nice but i suppose she's just trying to show off that really nice image at first but she's actually complete well i can't really say it on camera can i perhaps the world's greatest soap moment took place not a million miles from here in sunny melbourne Cast your minds back to 1987, to a sunny Ramsey Street, where a young Scott and Charlene are walking down the aisle to the sounds of Angry Anderson's Suddenly. Does David Beckham ever come in? Um, I'd like him to, you know what I mean? <laughs> tell me, tell me, does she have any gossip about any other celebrities? Who does she hate? Um, well, you know, there's all these rumours going around about Sophie, Eleanor Baxendale, but, um, it's all a lie, really. She does, she, she's not really going to tell him. The only people that she hates is Jerry, and, but I think the whole world knows that by now. One last question. Will you be buying her new single? Um, I could look at it in the single shop, but I don't know if I'll be buying it. <laughs> as long as she comes in to get her hair done, I'm happy. Well, as long as it's a cut above the rest. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> well, we'll be seeing you soon, and you can do my hair anytime. Oh, that's all right, darling. Come get an appointment. <laughs> Come back soon. Okay, Thanks, then. Christina. All right, Thank then. you. Thank you.